All right. Hi, everybody. All right, we are two cameras going. Um, I'm going to start taking these pins out of my morning project. Taking out my T-pins, I do have extra T-pins in the office. So if you need T-pins, my morning class seemed to lo lose a lot of their T-pins. Um, there's about five envelopes with about eight T-pins in each one. Um, so you can come to school. You don't even have to go to the office. Just open the front door, go to that table, look for a bag that says T-pins 7th and 8th. Now the hard part. We got T-pins on our bag? Yeah, there should be in a little white envelope. They look like this. I didn't get that. All right, then you're going to have to come to the office and pick some up. You can adapt and use staples or a paper clip. Now I'm going to gently kind of put my finger under here. And you'll notice the glue just breaks free. I'm gonna show you, we pin it down. And there's this. And notice they're mirror images of each other. I can set them on top of each other. They're the same thing. You, all right, and then I got from my morning class. So I have three of them done. So then it'll kind of look something like this as we're building it. You guys kind of see that? And that's going to be our kind of our, our, our tower. All right. So I built one per class. My morning class, it took me a while because I was learning just like you. These I knocked out in a class period, 20 minutes. All right. So the first thing we need to do is find it. Take, a, take one of these and put it. I want to make one of these balsa wood strips five squares. All right, so that's uh, 25 milliliters, or, uh, milliliter, millimeters, all right? So five squares. So if you look, hopefully this appears on the camera. I'm going to put it down somewhere. I'm going to count one, two, three, four, five, and I'm going to draw a line. All right, see that line? That's about how big it should be. Now I'm going to take my scissors, cut it from the back, not the front. I'm going to cut it a little bit behind. All right, I'm going to cut it a little bit behind. But Mr. J, wow, look at how there's a lot extra. Can you add wood? All right, we got some cameras on. All right, um, so I have fi uh, fi uh, 25, I think that's 25 millimeters. Um, but I got a, it's a little long. Now I take my sandpaper and I'm just going to rub it, stay 90 degrees straight up and down. And I'm going to start sanding it. See, we're almost there. I barely did anything. All right, maybe one more there. So we're going to make a little bitty stick as big as five squares on your graph paper. All right. Now... I'm going to lay it on the graph paper, on my tower. Are you going to sand it down? Sand it down so it's... Are you supposed to break it? No. I'd use scissors and cut it a little long. Cut it a little long and then sand down a sixteenth of an inch. And it comes off with 60 grit sandpaper. It comes off balsa wood sands really easy. All right, now we're gonna build our legs. Now everyone's legs are gonna be a little bit different. Mine are gonna be 300, or th let's see, um, 310 uh, millimeters. But I'm not gonna, I can use a yard, um, um, my ruler, or I can just put it next to the, put, put it on my, um, chart my graph paper line it up all right i put a mark down here so this is how big my leg the leg is going to be i don't know if you can see that mark right there all right now i take my scissors i cut it a little bit longer i cut it a little bit longer i cut it a little bit longer and now I start sanding it slightly on an angle to the line. And I want to match it up. 
There we go. So right about to there, you can barely see my line. And now I put it on the paper. And there's one leg. Now I need to make another leg. All right, same thing. Take my long, a long piece, put it on the graph paper, hold it up to the top line, mark the bottom line. I, I cut it a little bit long. Why do I, why does Mr. Jaminski cut it long? Yeah, he's cut. All right, anyway, um, I cut it long because if I cut it too short, I wrecked a piece of wood. You can still use it for the braces. Um, you, can, you can't add, add length. You can always take away. You can always sand a little bit off. And so that's what I do. I just sand a little bit off. All right, so I sand it off. I got a little angle on there, and I place it there. I line it up as best I can. And this is where I have to start using the pins. Hold on, I got people still coming in. Tommy and Julie is showing up. All right, who just said that? Is that Asia? Yeah, it's Let's see what you got. Yeah, that looks perfect. It should be square though, 90 degrees. Now put it on the, on the top. That's the top of your tower. What, what do you mean the top of my tower? Um, I can't lift up the screen. Remember that you, uh, how your tower looks like this? Yeah. It should be up by your fingers. So on your graph right paper. Here. Yep. Yep, right where your finger's at. That's how big it should be. Is that bit? No, it should be that flat piece on the top. Turn it. So right here? Yep, turn it flat so it's the top of the tower. Excellent. Are we supposed to glue it down? Then? No, pin it down. Now we're going to start gluing this thing. Now, your glue is just generic Elmer's glue. It has a cover on it. Take the cap off. All right? I think I told you about that the other day. Um, if it's not work, we had a couple kids have bad glue. Um, just get some Elmer's glue. I use a paper clip. See, I got a bent paper clip, and I just put a little glue on it. And now I take my little piece. See the little piece in my hand? I put a little dab of glue on that. I don't know if you can see that. Just a little dab of glue there, a little dab on the other side. You guys all know about dabbing. Uh, dabbing is so last year, right? So pre-COVID. Anyone still dab? Not after I said that. All right. So now I'm going to place it. And now I'm going to start pinning it. So I don't want it to move. So I'm going to... Are we supposed to, like, um, use two? Say again. You're supposed to have what at the top? To yeah, your legs are going to come down off that top piece. I'm going to have this pinned in a second, then I'll show you. All right, I'm almost there, guys. Hang in there. Then I'll have it pinned and. I'm going to probably put an. Give me a second here. Hold on. All right, all right, so let me get a couple more pins in and then I'm gonna pick up this board and show you. Almost there, almost there. All right, so Now you pick this up, everything's gonna go sliding. All right. See how I pin that? And the YouTube video will look much better. You'll be able to see. Are we supposed to pin it on into the wood? No, pin, here's how I want you to pin it. So if you got cardboard, you just pinch it. Something like this. 
Can you see that? How I did that? See how we pin that? All right, let's set this back up. All right, we're at the 10 minute mark on the video. So I wanna get a brace in, and then I can shut the camera off. And then we can start talking questions. Um, so now I'm gonna start putting my braces in. So I'm just gonna kinda hold it on there, put a mark with a pencil, now here's where you can do the overlap or the butt joint. It's up to you. It is up to you. The overlapping joint is easier than a butt joint. It's a lot easier. I'm doing butt joints I just because I'm doing them. I wanna see how hard it is. Um, so I'm gonna take a little bit of glue. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna take my, I um, lost my pencil. So I take my first mark. I'm using a Sharpie here. I do my first mark. Yeah, that's my Sharpie. I cut it a little higher. So I cut it on an angle. I run it on the sandpaper. Oh, there goes my camera. Oops. There. I take my sandpaper. smooth it out something like that put it on there mine's a little long I gotta knock it down a little bit and there we go all right so I'm gonna repin that a little tighter. All right. Now, still just a little long. Now it'll be too short. How are we doing? We hanging in there? glue my first one my first brace so I got it cut on the edges put a little drop of glue butter up some glue on that butter up some glue put it on there and this will look much better on my the YouTube video I do with this now I want to pin it down so it doesn't move It takes time, yeah, it takes a while. Don't, try not to rush your glue. Hold on, I'm almost there. Just gluing one. I can't put the other sticks down without messing up the glue though. And well then, then to be safe, if you wanna keep yourself really safe, this could be a stopping point. So I just did one brace. Here, I'm gonna hold this up again. I just did this bottom brace, all right? And I got a lot of pins in. Should take about 12 pins, uh, maybe a little more if you got cardboard. All right, I'm gonna stop this video. I'm gonna talk really quick to the video camera one more time and then um, shut it off. Now I just have to cut this one, make a mark, cut this one, cut that one, that one and that one. So if you make a mistake, you can always save it and use it for a shorter piece up here. All right, guys, that's the YouTube video. And cut.